as you're standing, hold on to the handrail. Please keep your hands, arms, feet, and legs. And I'm Joe. And we're Jen and Joe. And on Jen the go. go. We're walking, which means we're on the go. Jen, what are we doing? Joe, we are at the Magic Kingdom today. And we are in line for well, the kinda, Haunted Mansion. You can kind of sort of see it, the Haunted Mansion. Um, we never do videos like this. Yeah, <laughs> while we're walking We're in line. always stationary. Yeah, and... because I'm afraid I'm going to trip and fall and like hurt myself. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not young anymore, Jen. I can't do two things at the same time. So we just wanted to pop in and say that it's about 10.45. We got here maybe an hour ago and we've already ridden Pirates of the Caribbean and Big Thunder Mountain Railroad twice. twice. And now we're in line, like we said, for Haunted Mansion. Yeah, it was a 10 minute wait until about two minutes ago. Now it's up to 20. Yeah, so, but still not bad. That's right, we did Haunted, uh, or um, Thunder Mountain twice. So that's yes. good, now we're on Haunted. So we've got a few things uh, lined up for today. We're gonna check in. I'll let you know what the wait times are for a lot of this stuff. This is the day before the 50th anniversary yes. celebration. So, so this will be a good comparison um, between the crowds today and the crowds tomorrow. Right, exactly, yeah. exactly. So, all right, we'll uh, be back in a bit. Yes, we will. All right, so we're uh, taking a break now. I'm currently sitting on Joe's lap. My best part of the day so far. Anyway, uh, Haunted Mansion, great, excellent, wonderful. Um, again, we... You know, we should have come in earlier today. Uh, we could have come in at 8.30 because park opening was 9. We probably could have gotten through everything at that point. Yeah. But so far, it's actually been pretty good. Oh, look at that. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Oh, yum. I got... Thank you so much. Oktoberfest, Sam Adams. Good way to start. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So we're at Liberty Tree Tavern. Thank you. We are sitting down to lunch because we really didn't have breakfast, so we skipped a meal. Um, but everything so far at Magic Kingdom, even though we didn't get here to the park till 10, the first hour we rode those four rides. Um, even Haunted Mansion, when we got in that line, they said 20 minutes, and it was not. It was okay, five minutes. I can't minutes. sit here anymore, so Joe can finish talking, but hi. You're going to go eat your salad? Yeah. Look, we got salad. Jen was sitting in a nice, comfortable lap. And it that, really wasn't comfortable. It was very comfortable. You're just getting old, dear. All right, we'll check in later. Bye for now. And then we'll just walk back there to the... Um, All right, so I just need to say, lunch was really, really, really good. It was really good. We've always enjoyed our meals at Liberty Tree Tavern. Yeah, so, you know, you get the uh, pork, turkey, the beef pot roast, mashed potatoes, macaroni and cheese, green beans. Stuffing. The stuffing with cranberries, the cranberry sauce. Salad the and salad. rolls. Yes, yes, you and, get all of um, that. And a soft drink. 
I ended up getting a beer, but you know, any of the alcohol is a little extra. Uh, oh, and the ooey gooey coffee cake, which we did not get because yeah. personally I'm not a fan and we were just full. And I like it, but I just, I can't do sugar anymore. It's just killing me. So I have been trying to cut back a little bit, uh, trying to eat a little healthier. And this, okay, so out of what was on the plate, what do you think was your favorite? Oh, definitely the mashed potatoes. Yeah, the mashed potatoes are fantastic, yeah. but I loved the beef, the pot roast. Um, it's basically like just the beef that you make at home, but yeah. flavorful and really, really, really tender. And yeah, the mashed potatoes are great. And then the stuffing, which you don't really like stuffing, I had that and I mixed it with the cranberry to die for. It yeah. was so good. So anyway, we highly recommend Liberty Tree Tavern. We do. If you walk out of there hungry, you ain't eating because that's it's all you can eat. You can ask for more. And you asked for more potatoes, didn't you? I did. You? I yeah, did. you did. I yeah. did. It was good. So we're going to go ride more rides because, again, the wait times are extremely low. Joe's going to pan. We're in um, the Liberty... Liberty Square. Liberty Square. Yeah. Duh. Um, yeah. Just to show you guys how it is, it's it's not crowded at all again. Yeah, it's really. I think the lull before the storm tomorrow is the 50th, so it's going to be massively crowded yeah. tomorrow. But today, so far, has been pretty good. Okay, let's pan the crowd and then we're going to go ride some more rides. All right, let's go ride some rides. <laughs> Second star on the right, and straight on till morning. So what are we doing now? Well, we stopped in Gaston's Tavern for a little snacky snacky. And of course, we had to get the LeFou's Brew. You we, have to. We love LeFou's Brew. Mm -hmm. It is really sweet and tasty and yummy and refreshing. Mm -hmm. It's a good little spot to take a five to ten minute break yeah. to just have a little snack. So again, the crowd levels, it's on September 30th, have been so low today. Yeah. We waited in line for Seven Dwarfs Mine Train for about 20-ish minutes, 25 minutes. Yeah, probably about 22. 
and that was in the middle of the afternoon. Like, it wasn't early morning, it wasn't late at night, it was about one o'clock when we got in line for Seven Dwarfs Mine Train and we waited 22 minutes. And everything else we, well, Peter Pan, we probably walked, it was about a 10 minute, 20 mm, Peter minute Peter Pan wait? was 20. 20? Yeah, they said 35 yeah. minutes for Peter Pan, we waited yeah. 20. They said 40 minutes for Seven Dwarfs, we waited 22. So, mm -hmm. that's that. Everything mm -hmm. else has pretty much been a walk on. I mean, yeah. you know, and we've done everything except for some of the bigger ones. We didn't do Space Mountain. I can't do that anymore. I'm yeah, no, 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 I can't do that. We haven't, done, haven't haven't even gone to Tomorrowland yet, but no, we have plans. We're, doing we're, gonna, that next. we're gonna try to get on Buzz Lightyear and People Mover, and then we're going back to the resort to swim and relax yeah. because we've done everything. Yeah, I mean for the most part, there are no fireworks I mean, tonight. What time is it? It's about two ish, a little before two. So we've been here for about four hours, and we've ridden. No, we got here at ten. Yeah, that's yeah, four hours. Right. 11, 12, 12, 12. Oh, yeah. Mm, I can tell time. I've always said math is not my strong suit. I'm sorry. I, uh, yes, four hours. Sorry, Ken. So we've gotten on Pirates, Big Thunder Mountain twice, Haunted Mansion, Peter Pan, Seven Dwarfs Mine Train, Little Mermaid. We had lunch at Liberty Tree Tavern and have now stopped for a little snacky snooky. So yeah. that's a lot in four yeah, hours. Yeah, yeah, it is. This is yeah. a really good day. Been pretty good. No complaints. So. so that means we can't complain about tomorrow, October 1st, because I think it's going to be obscene. Yeah, it we'll probably see. will be. Yeah, yeah, exactly. All so, right. All right, so we'll we still have more. Later. Yeah. We have a treat. The Carousel of Progress was Walt's own idea from beginning to end. He loved it. He introduced the show at the World's Fair in New York City in 1964, and it was an immediate smash hit. Millions of people came to see it. And since then, the Carousel of Progress has had more performances than any other stage show in the history of American theater. You know, Walt loved the idea of progress, and he loved the American family. And he himself was probably as American as anyone could possibly be. He thought it would be fun to watch the American family go through the 20th century, experiencing all the new wonders as they came. And he put them together in a show called Carousel of Progress. Well, we have one of those new talking machines. Now that is something. It plays music right here in our home. There's a great big beautiful tomorrow. She keeps that thing going all day long. Progress. Oh, Papa. Yes, Patricia? Papa, all these people. I'm, I'm indecent. <laughs> Don't worry, Patricia. They're friends. That's our teenage daughter. She's getting ready to go to a Valentine's dance across town on one of those new horseless trolleys. I think it's very romantic you're taking Mother out for Valentine's dinner this evening. Well, you know what kind of sport I am. I only hope I have an evening as romantic as yours and Mother's. Now, you be home by 9 o'clock, daughter. You hear me? Yes. Oh, well, with all this talking, I've worked up quite a thirst. <laughs> I think I'll take one of those newfangled trolleys down to the drugstore soda fountain and meet the boys for a cold sarsaparilla. Oh, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I forgot. We're drinking root beer now. Same kind of thing, different name. Well, that's progress for you. So we are right at the entrance of Adventureland. At the spring roll cart. At the spring roll cart. So the spring roll cart uh, currently has a special spring roll, and it's the celebration spring roll, and we're about to have it now. And it's pastrami, uh, pepper jack cheese with a mustard sauce. Yes. And so, we got that and the cheeseburger spring roll. So we actually ate the cheeseburger one already, so apologize for that. We but, devoured that. <laughs> yeah, but here's the celebration one, and we got two sauces. So there's the mustard sauce that comes with the celebration one. So Jennifer, why don't you do the honors? Okay. Oh, that's hot. All right, I'm well, going to dip it, it in the mustard because I am a big fan of mustard. And in true Disney fashion, we're eating over a garbage can. Yeah, well, you got to do what you got to do. Mm. Is that good? The first one was uh, um, Celebration Egg Roll. This is a cheeseburger one. What? Yeah. No. Yeah, she'll know it once you eat it. Yep. Really? Yeah. Here. Wow, that was an epic fail. That's okay. I'll post it on Instagram so you guys can see the pictures. Yeah, wow. this is the cheeseburger. That was such one. an epic fail. I thought oh, well. the other one had pastrami in it. Really? Uh huh. Well, that other one was really good. I'll tell you that. Mm. So 
we may have been an epic fail at the picture taking and the eating of the spring rolls, but that celebration spring roll with the pastrami and the pepper jack cheese was delicious. <laughs> As is the cheeseburger spring roll. Yeah. Delicious. Mm. You know the day is magical when everyone looks like a princess. All right, we are back in the hotel room, uh, actually sitting out on the balcony of our hotel room. Yeah. Not a bad view. It's a nature wow. view. It's really pretty. And yeah. I think we can see the fireworks, too. Yeah, we're because um, we're, we're located at Wilderness Lodge, we could actually see the contemporary. So we can possibly see uh, Magic Kingdom fireworks. We'll the see. new enchantment. Yes, we'll see. Uh, tomorrow we'll actually be in Magic Kingdom to see it, but perhaps maybe Saturday night from here. But speaking of Magic Kingdom, let's wrap yes. up Magic Kingdom. Yes, so today being that it's the day before the big celebration, uh, today is Thursday. The park was empty. We were much. able to ride so much, no to little wait times. Yeah. Um, just a great day. It was warm today. Being that we're just about into October, it's still, it was 91 degrees It was toasty. Today. It, was, it was warm. Uh, but, you know, we managed. It was fine. Um, we did a couple of things that we've never... Well, one thing in particular we didn't do before, and that was Carousel of Progress. We did. Together, anyway. We've done it years and years ago. I haven't ridden it since I was a little kid. Yeah, it just... Uh, I don't know. It was really kind of cool. It was kind of fun. It was. Um, I really liked it. It's a 20-minute show, just in case if you've never done that before. It is 20 minutes long, so you do... But, you know, it's air-conditioned. It's a nice little break. It's cute. Sit. It's funny. Um, yeah, so it, it's based on uh, what Walt Disney was doing with the 1964 World's Fair and just the animatronics that they developed for the World's Fair, which then led into so many of the other things that we see throughout all of Disney uh, with the animatronics and whatnot. So, anyway, very nice day today. It was a good day. Yeah, so... We just wanted to wrap it up. Yeah, so it was really, really a good time. I had a nice time with you I here. I did too. Nice to be back at the Kingdom of Magic. It was. And tomorrow will be even more magical. Or not. Or not. Lots of people. So don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell because you don't want to miss any of the next Jen and Joe on the go action. You said it. So, all right, we will talk to you later. Bye, guys. Bye. Thank you for watching.